Here's how to enable the classic Windows 7 like legacy boot menu in Windows 11. It helps avoid double restart when switching between the installed operating systems. Users that update from Windows 7 to Windows 10 and 11 will notice that Microsoft has fully redesigned the boot menu in newer operating systems. Instead of the simple classic menu with the black background and a list of available operating systems, Windows shows a more modern interface that requires an additional restart. This tutorial will show you how to how to restore the Windows 7 like boot menu in Windows 11. It prevents Windows from restarting when choosing another OS. This is useful for those who use more than one operating system on a single computer, dual boot. The procedure is straightforward and only requires a couple of commands in the command prompt. Launch Windows Terminal with Administrator Privileges. Right-click the Start Menu button and select Windows Terminal, Admin. Switch Windows Terminal to the Command Prompt Profile. Click the arrow down button on the tab strip and select command prompt. Enter the following command, bigdedit slash set current bootmina policy legacy. Press enter to execute the command. Restart your computer to see the changes in action. You are done. One simple command turns on the legacy Windows 7 like boot menu on systems with Windows 11. Please keep in mind that upgrading Windows 11 to a newer build will automatically restore the newer boot menu appearance and disable the legacy boot manager. This situation is very common among Windows insiders who regularly receive new builds in the dev channel. That's it. If you like the video give a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe.